New at 6, Fort Lauderdale Hollywood Airport held a disaster drill today. It's mandated as part of the airport's operating certification from the FAA. CBS 4 photojournalist Peter Miranda shows us the training, which is designed with our safety in mind. Today is Operation Silver Lining. Um, our airport, like most commercial service airports, were required to actually do a full-scale exercise uh, at least once every three years. What you're going to see today is a simulated aircraft crash, an aircraft that would have been landing on runway 28 left that has encounters a bird strike uh, and then ultimately an engine uh, failure and lands and slides off the runway. Each time we do one of these, we try to pick out something a little bit different, challenge the team, uh, rise to the occasion, uh, no matter whether it's a, uh, in this case here, uh, where an engine fire and failure, or there might have been some other type of incident that occurred. Once they get the fire knocked down, then they'll start search and rescue operations to find who they can, extricate uh, those that they need to, and then begin working on a triage and transport uh, arrangement, getting folks that are injured off to hospitals. We unfortunately have had a lot of experience with real incidents out here at the airport. And one of the biggest things we believe in is training. And we train constantly, whether it's in the eye of the media or behind the scenes. And we're only as good as our last training whether it's an active shooter or it's an aircraft type of incident. 